Hello everybody, in this video I want to show you how you can combine multiple video files into one on Windows 11. It's completely free to do and doesn't require you to download any extra software. And the process is super easy and straightforward, so let's just get started. So the software we're going to be using today for this is called Clipchamp. It is a free video editor that's automatically installed on Windows 11 computers. So to access it, we're just going to go to our Windows search bar here at the bottom and type in Clipchamp, just like so. If you're on Windows 10 or you're on Windows 11 and for some reason it's not automatically installed, you can type in a Microsoft Store here and then go inside the store and search for Clipchamp on there and install it real quick. The one downside about this software over the old Windows Movie Maker is that you do have to create an account and sign in to use it. I already have an account connected with Google so I just click on this here but you probably need to go up here and create an account. So once you sign in and create your account we're going to be taken to this page here where we're going to create our first video project. We have a lot of templates we can choose from depending on what type of video we're making. As you can see, we could make a YouTube video, a gaming video, a TikTok video, but we're going to be doing something very simple, which is just combining two of our other videos. So we're just going to click this create a new video, start from scratch button up here. And now here is where we can officially start editing our video. So the very first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to come up to the top here where it says untitled video, and we're going to give our video file a name. So I'll just call it combined. All right, so now we are ready to import our video clips, and we can do this in either two ways. One way is you can have your video files on your desktop here, and then you just want to select them, and then drag it into this Import Media section. Or you can click on this Import Media button, and then go and find the videos in your File Explorer. So the two videos I got here are just some stock footage I found online of New York City, and to go ahead and start combining these clips together, I need to drag them down here to what's called our timeline. So now you want to go ahead and select the clip that you want to play first and then you just want to drag it onto your timeline down here. You're going to see a green box. And now as you can see we now have a preview of this video and we can click on this play button to play through it if we'd like. And now I'll go ahead and put our second clip on the timeline. Now it's important when you come and place your video on your timeline that you put the second clip directly right next to the first one without a space between them. You want to do that so your first video clip will flow right into the next one. Now let's say that you messed up and you put the clips in the wrong order here. To fix that all you need to do is take the clip you want to move and then drag it behind the other clip. And now to get rid of this blank space here in the beginning we're just going to hover over it and then click on the trash icon. Alright so now I am ready to go and combine these clips and turn them into one file. To do that we're going to go up to the top and click on export. And now as you can see here we have three different options. We can go for 480p, 720p, or 1080p. I'd recommend going with the highest quality and selecting 1080p because the file size isn't really that big anyway, but if you do care about the file size a lot, you can go with 720p. I wouldn't recommend going with 480p under any circumstances. The quality is just too bad. So I'm going to go ahead and select 1080p. And now as you can see, our video is rendering and exporting. Alright, so once it's done exporting, our file should be automatically saved to our computer. Most likely, it's going to be in your download section. So I'm going to go ahead and open up my downloads, and as you can see, it is right here at the top, so I'll go ahead and click on it. And now here we go, we got my two clips combined into one video. So yeah, that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, just leave it down in the comments, and if this video helped you, a like and subscribe would be greatly appreciated.